Hey everybody, welcome back to League of Legends. We're doing another entry into, or rather the second entry, into the Bilgewater battle uh, between Twisted Fate and Graves. Uh, so this match is going to be is Riven, Akali, Rek'Sai, Felkaz, and uh, Callista versus Karthus, Jack, Syndra, Twitch, and Nidalee. So last time we met up, uh, Twisted Fate was scouting out this area that he was. It's, it seems like he's gonna rob. I mean, you know, he's, he's a thief, uh, so it seems like he's gonna rob. Uh, so picking right back where they, where where he was. This uh, they think no one would be fool enough to come here. A bloated corpse hangs overhead, a warning for all to see. It spins slowly in the midnight breeze coming off the harbor. It's an ugly sight. A huge hook, the type used to catch devilfish, holds the body aloft. Stepping over rusted chains, lying limp upon the wet stone, I pass between a pair of towering cranes. They're used to haul giant sea creatures into the slaughter sheds for butchering. It's those looming factories that are the source of this god-awful stench that permeates everything here. Alright, so I just heard the game start, so that's my cue to switch over. By the way, I'm playing as Riven, which is a champion that I may have played as a handful of times? She's, she's cool. Um, but I'm not going to go out of my way to say that I'm good with her. Uh, um, so, you know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take, take the defensive route. So I'm going to grab that, and I'm going to grab a sword. And then I'm going to grab some potions. Might as well grab as many as I can. Which one gives her the... Yeah, okay, so I know that one's important. Dealing and stunning them, and another stun is important. And then that's her dash, I guess. Dash in a direction. No, these are all important. We'll, we'll take all. We'll take all. Of them. Why not? We can't. Hurt. Here come the minions. Their minions are coming. I didn't do a whole lot, but I got in there and I did something. Jump in this fight! Gotcha. See, I know how to do things. Hey, I got someone that one. Oh, but I'm dead. But, um, I love these towers. Love, love, love these towers. Drink a potion, drink a potion. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm very dead. <laughs> I did that wrong. I did that wrong. I gotta feed you. Come here. Gates are opening. Dodged it. Time since I was against a Karthus, but what you used to be able to do 
is anytime you saw the ult coming down, you could use the Fortitude Potion, and it would give you enough health back that it uh, wouldn't matter. Wow. Across the bay, past the chum churned waters of the slaughtered docks, scores of ships lie at anchor, their lanterns swinging gently. One of these vessels draws my eye, a massive black sailed war galleon. I know those ships, excuse me, I know whose ship that is. Everyone in Bilgewater knows. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. You saved my ass! Take a moment to gloat. I'm about to steal from the most powerful man in town. There's always a certain thrill that comes from spitting in, the, in death's eye. As expected, the main warehouse is locked up tighter than a noble woman's virtue. Guards posted at every entrance, doors locked and barred. For anyone other than me, it would be impossible to break into. I did it! We did it! We did stuff together! I did it! I did it! Three kills, guys! Three kills! I did it! Dude was right, though. The tank definitely is helped. Oh, no, she's dead. She's dead. She's dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I ducked into a blind alley opposite the warehouse. It's a dead end, and it's not as dark as I would have liked. If I'm still here when the mo when the patrol comes back, they'll see me. And if they get a hold of me, the best I can hope for is a quick death. More likely, I'll be taken to him. And that would be a far more painful, drawn-out way to go. I was looking at one of my old videos from early in the channel uh, for League of Legends, and I couldn't believe how much of a graphical improvement this game has seen. Damn, that Belkaz does not hit with his laser very well. But then again, I suck, so I ain't got much room to talk for him. The trick, as always, is to not get caught. Then I hear them. The bruisers are returning early. I have seconds at best. I snap a card from my sleeve and weave it through my fingers. It's as natural as breathing. This is the easy part. The rest can't be rushed. I let my mind drift as the card starts to glow. Pressure builds around me and I'm nearly overcome with the promise of everywhere. Half closing my eyes, I focus and picture where I need to be. Then there's the familiar lurch in the guts as I shift, a displacement of air and I'm inside the warehouse, gone with barely a trace. Damn, I'm good. 
one of the jagged hooks outside. Mike glanced up the alley and noticed a single playing card falling to the ground. But probably not. It takes just a moment for me to get my bearings. Dim light from the lanterns outside creep into the cracks in the walls. My eyes adjust. Okay, there we go. Okay, I think we're good now. Ain't GG yet, we gotta get this down. It isn't GG, it's early. And therefore, I'm a country bumpkin. We got it, 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 we got it. Victory! Yeah! The warehouse is crowded, stacked high with treasures from all over. The Twelve Seas, gleaming suits of armor, exotic works of art, shining skills, excuse me, shining silks, all things of considerable value, but not what I am here for. My attention is drawn to the loading doors at the front of the warehouse, where I know I'll find the most recent arrivals. I run my finger grips across the various cartons and crates until I come to a small wooden box. I can feel the power emanating from within. This is what I'm here for. I unlatch the lid. My prize is revealed. A knife of exquisite design lying upon a bed of black velvet. I reach for it. Cha-chunk! I freeze. There's no mistaking that sound. Before he even speaks, I know who's standing behind me. TF, says Graves. It's been a long time. Anyways, hey, thanks for watching, everybody. That is the end of Part 2, Act 1. The next video will have most of, if not all of, Part 2 in it. Um, and thank you for watching. It's been fun. Catch you later. Bye-bye.